Hi guys, welcome to the Music b, &B. My name is Callum and today we are reacting to an artist known as Miami with the single Lost. Now, a bit of background about Miami. It has been provided by the artist. So I'm going to take a deep breath. I'm going to read you through it. Let's go. This is the single Lost by the artist Miami. The album transformation has come to fruition despite physical distances as the 12 songs were created through an Atlantic crossing collaborative process. Christian Paulson, currently residing in Brazil, handled the production while the vocals were recorded by Nikolai Willem in Copenhagen. Shane Diamond in southern Denmark contributed to the guitar work. Drums were recorded by Rasmus Skibai outside Copenhagen and the distinctive and recurring trumpet was recorded by Christian Paulson, also in Brazil. Miami is now making the return to the music scene with the album Transformation. Links in the description and I apologise if I said any of those names wrong. It was not my intent to offend anyone. Let's go. If you like it, make sure to add it to your streaming services. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's very rock and roll. But like indie rock. Okay. and cool, it's upbeat, it's fun. Did you sell your soul for a bucket of money? Hey, you, still throwing TVs out of holes, the room, still wearing leather pants and jewels. Is this about, is this about someone who's like um, stuck in the past kind of singer or something? I'm liking the chorus though. Quite funny. Maybe you're lost in the desert. Good amount of like um, harmonies, backing, everything like that. The deal. Really well produced. Got a house and a snowmobile. Way back in 93. I saw you lip sync on MTV. Where did you go? Play nice like backing vocals there. Where did you go with your play by back? Nice varied second verse, it's not copy and paste deal. It's the kind of song you want to do that to. But I'm, yeah, I'm too cringe to do any of that, so I won't. <gasps> it's wedded. It takes me back to sort of the mid 2000s indie rock sound. Very nicely done, considering these people were not in the same room to make these songs. This is a bit um, overextended, I think, this section. Like, it's all stuff I've heard. It's just a bit of showy off grandioseness here at the moment, I think. Nice. Yeah, I really enjoyed that. Production was great, singing was great, harmonies. It felt like a cohesive band. It didn't feel like it was recorded in separate places. It felt like it was all together. One thing I would say is the ending felt a little bit overextended with the solos. And, you know, it was no, there was not much different in that ending. It almost felt like, let's try and get this to three minutes kind of deal there. But not bad, it, you know, it's okay to let things ride out. And, you know, maybe if I was, if you caught me on a different day, I'd be interested. But towards the back end, I think that would be the part where, where I would skip because it's like, yeah, I've heard this. But that's only a small gripe. And this is a really, really awesome song. So if you like it, make sure to add it to your streaming services. It is linked in the description down below. That was Miami with Lost. In a world where everyone wants to be heard and no one is doing the listening, be the one that does the listening. Goodbye, I guess. Bye, ladies and gentlemen.